Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. Let's take a start with IELTS reading. And today we are going to solve one test, which is gender training IELTS reading test. Uh, let me tell you question type that we have in academic or gender training. They are same. The first thing. Uh, the second thing is marking criteria is different for gender training. If you get 30 correct answers, unfortunately, you get six bands. In academic reading, if you get 30 correct answers, you will get 7 band. Marking criteria is different, right? One thing. Second, section 3 of academic and section 3 of gender training, they are also same. So if you are academic, no worries, you can take one gender training reading test. And if you are gender training, already it's good. What I recommend academic students, if initially they don't understand IELTS reading, and IELTS reading becomes a sort of horrible thing for them, then they should start with GT reading, solve some tests with GT reading, and then you can come to academic reading. And if you are gender training IELTS candidates and your reading score is stuck at a point, it is not increasing, then it's a good idea to solve minimum four academic reading tests. And after that, when you take again, you come back to gender training reading, your score will, score will increase, right? So I'll go through all these things. Again, I tell you tips and techniques, they are same. There is no difference at all. The questions that we have in academic or gender training questions are also same. True, false, not given, yes, no, not given, and all that, right? Now, let's take a start, please. Uh, whenever you start any test, first of all, you should read the title, title of the passage. So what's the title here? The best travel wallets. Now wallet we know, but travel wallet, maybe it's something different. The best travel wallets. Uh, there we have the subheading. Keep all your bank cards, documents, passports, and ID in one of these convenient carriers, which have been selected by Bika Meyer. So we understand all these are A, B, C, D until G. These are wallets, right? And by the way, in each paragraph, they will tell us about wallet. They will tell us about the pockets and uh, make and color and material and all that. So just imagine a wallet, right? That will help you. After reading the title and subtitle of the passage, then you will come to the questions so that you know. And by the way, you should be able to identify every question type. That's very, very important. Identify means you take a look at the question and you should know, yes, I know. This is which paragraph contains the following. And after the identification of the question, the next thing is you should know how to deal with that question type. How to deal means whether you need to read the questions first or the passage first and how to do that all. I also call it action plan. So identify the question type and for each question type, you should have a uh, action plan and then you can follow that very thing, right? Uh, otherwise you will do reading blindly. Blindly means a chakidar, either, either, all that. So it should not be like that. Now we come to questions, please. The very next page. Questions one to eight. Look at the seven reviews of travel wallets A to G on page 84. For which travel wallet are the following statements true? Now, what you're going to do, this is what we call matching. You will match the statements with the paragraphs. Is this clear? How bolo te say? All right, good. Yeah, chai bhi pee liya, phir bhi awaz nahi nikal rahi. Ho ki chai da tinu? Huh? Good, very good. So, uh, these are the wallets. In the in the passage, we've got the wallets, and in the questions, me we may have the features of the wallets. So we got to just match them. Now look here, in order to deal with this question type, first of all, uh, let me tell you, we've got three reading techniques or three type of readings. The first one is skimming, skimming. Just imagine you have newspaper, full newspaper, and you've got only three minutes to go through the newspaper to find out the main news. So will you read everything? Just headlines right important news some details then you go on like you know people don't read all the newspaper so when they are reading the newspaper mostly they are skimming one news from there one from there one from there one from there some news they overlook they don't read that that is what we call skimming clear now after skimming the second type is not actually reading it's actually searching 
it's actually looking and uh, in IELTS language we call it scanning right so when you do scanning scanning means you are looking for specific piece of information you are looking for specific word you are looking for the synonyms for specific word and when you scan you do not read try to understand that when you scan you do not read therefore you can scan from left to right or right to left you can scan in waves and all that so when you are scanning you're looking for a word let's do some scanning practice please come to this title uh, come back to the previous page okay all right now please scan the word navy blue scan the word navy blue mil jaye to meri taraf dekhna shuru kar dein good scan the word navy blue don't read only scan up down here there wave mein scan kare you can scan in waves scan in cross ek aise cross ek aise cross ek aise and all that navy blue navy blue come on scan navy blue good very good scan navy blue very good navy blue mil jaye to samne dekhna shuru kar dein scan navy blue some heads down still good mil gaya ha good so paragraph yeah mujhe khud bhi bhul gaya kahan pe tha paragraph d now you found this word navy blue now this is what we call scanning and when you are scanning you are not reading warning you are not reading therefore if you tend to read then i mean english language is written from left to right don't scan left to right scan right to left when you scan right to left you will not read because words will not make any sense right now let's do some more practice scanning okay this time you guys are going to find me word flight tickets flight tickets good flight tickets some of you are very good huh flight tickets flight tickets flight tickets well done yeah and in your brain the word flight tickets flight tickets flight tickets is going on all right got it good good still searching found it okay flight tickets so where is that in paragraph just before the navy okay that's right now let's move on uh you got to find another word from the same passage this time please look for the word don't look at my eyes ah huh? <laughs> okay all right pvc look for pvc very simple ha huh? exactly pvc is very simple excellent very good now look for the word new york new york come on new york come on guys it's so simple new york n capital y capital new york come on simple word new york n capital y capital not given <laughs> okay all right all right okay so this word is not there right so it doesn't mean that you're scanning 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 you should say it's not there right okay that's good now let's come to paragraph a as you've got the pencil if you're taking computer delivered ielts you've got the mouse with you right and when you right click you can highlight you can underline you can do all these things right so paragraph a uh kipling travel doc travel document holder this zipped around wallet underline zipped around now have you seen some wallets they've got zips on all four sides zipped around all sides they have zip that is called zipped around wallet three sides comes in five different patterns underline five different patterns made of nylon underline nylon it also has a space where users can put a pen underline put a pen pockets for cards underline pockets an id window underline id window and a pocket for change pocket for change means coins change means coins now listen if your imagination is on you are imagining a wallet and then you're reading all these things at the back of your head these things will stick automatically if you imagine 
then the things will stick. Now we go on and we've got the questions. Okay, now listen. When you read the questions, read each question carefully because second time when you go back to the passage, you will match the questions with the passage. Now you're going to match passage with questions. After reading the questions, when you go for the second passage, then you will match questions actually with the passage. So question number one. Wallet will suit people who prefer natural materials. Underline natural material. And what is natural material? That is, that is found in nature, any material. Underline that. Question number two. Users of this wallet do not need to worry about taking it out in the rain. It means the wallet is waterproof. Underline that. And keep in mind also. Imagine rain, imagine wallet and all that. Waterproof. Question number three. Parts of the inside of this wallet have categories printed on them in one color. Now, inside and categories printed on them in one color. So, it's question number three. Question number four. This wallet would suit someone who needs to keep several passports together. Underline several passports together. Like, you know, three to four passports, right? For frequent flyers and all that. Let's go on. Question number five. Something is provided for writing. What is that? Pen. See that? Chalagi check karein. They will not use the word pen. They will say something is provided for writing. That can be pen, pencil. But actually they, they did not say you can keep your pen in that. They said pen will be provided or wallet comes with a pen. They said something is provided for writing. Now all these things must be imagined. If you don't imagine, these things will fly out of your head, right? Next, question number six. Uh, this will suit people who want to be able to find their document wallet easily in their luggage. Now, underline in their luggage. Document wallet easily. So, suit people who want to be able to find their document wallet easily in their luggage. Means the, the wallet has a different color and they can easily identify. All right, question number seven. Let's go on. Something to keep this wallet is uh, in is provided. Something to keep this wallet in. This cheese ke andar wallet rakhne will be provided. It can be a cover. Cover for wallet. Case for wallet. Box for wallet. Or anything like that. Question number 8. This wallet has been specifically made to prevent people detecting the numbers on any bank cards. You know they can even detect numbers from your wallet. They have some devices, wallet is in your pocket, they can detect the numbers. So, this wallet has been specifically made to prevent people uh, detecting the numbers on any bank cards. Now, by the way, paragraph A says zip around wallet, five different patterns, nylon. Nylon, they said here, and it's not natural. They said you can put a pen. They did not say, they did not say that wallet will come with a pen. They said you can put a pen, pen up now. For that, they said pen saath uh, ID windows and all that. Now, paragraph A, does it match with any question? It doesn't. Paragraph A does not match with any question. Zabardasti nahi karni. It's not ke kahin na kahin kuch na kuch lazmi hoga. Okay? But now we are familiar with questions. So, let's just take a start. Paragraph B, please. Everyone, please come to paragraph B. And by the way, it's not necessary to read the name of the wallet. Let's start. This is a waterproof wallet. See, yeah, waterproof wallet. Now you know, actually, you can use the wallet in rain. So this is a waterproof wallet. Question number two. Now, in front of question number two, you will write capital B. And on your answer sheet, where two is given, there you will write capital B. I'm again saying capital B. Don't write small b, capital B, and write it clearly. Okay. And by the way, when one question is done, cross it from there. Now, number two, cross kar de. Number two, go cross kar de. Because one option will be used once only. So, just cross number two so that it doesn't bother you again and again. For good time management. Yeah. Okay. Let's come back, please. Uh, which used NTRFID radio frequency identification material so... Your financial details will be safe. Exactly. Your financial details will be safe. Right? Now, what is that? 
क्वेश्चन नंबर एट दिस वॉलेट हैज बिन स्पेसिफिकली मेड टू प्रिवेंट पीपल डिटेक्टिंग द नंबर ऑन एनी बैंक कार्ड नाउ डिटेक्टिंग द नंबर ऑन एनी बैंक कार्ड फॉर दैट द यूज द वर्ड फाइनेंशियल डिटेल्स विल बी सेफ आई गॉट सच वॉलेट दैट वॉज गिफ्टेड बाई वन ऑफ माई फ्रेंड्स फ्रॉम ऑस्ट्रेलिया या सो इट्स गॉट दैट थिंग All right. So, paragraph B, question number two, and question number eight. Now, please cross eight also, so that you don't read it again. When you come back, you don't read it. Now we go to paragraph C. A wallet so slim it could easily pass for a small notebook. Okay. The inside compartment labels identifying each separate section all have silver lettering on them. now go back and see something inside compartment labels identifying each separate section all have silver lettering on them uh 5 6 five is something is provided for writing no six is will get suit people who want to be able to find their document wallet no three parts of the inside of this wallet have categorized categories printed on now please go back and see what is the word for categories printed on them in one color and what is that color silver. that color is silver and for categories they use the word actually labels identifying each separate section all have silver lettering on them lettering means like a b c and all that question number 5 question number 5 where Are you talking about paragraph C? Let me read it again. A wallet so slim it could easily pass for a small notebook. It could easily pass. Heading number five. Number five. You're saying number five is different. Something is provided for writing. No, no, no. Listen. Don't don't mix this. Listen. What they're saying here. Wallet is as slim as a notebook. Do you understand? Wallet is as slim as a notebook does not mean that you will get a notebook with wallet, right? Yeah, exactly. Okay. Now let's go on. Uh, please come to paragraph D. D for doctor. Ted Baker Voyager. Uh, you don't need to read the name, by the way. Paragraph D. This wallet comes in smooth black leather. Black leather. Where do we get the leather from? Yes, natural material. Okay, so black leather they said, and leather is natural material. Why natural? Because we get leather from animals. Okay, so animals belong to nature, so that is natural material. Do you understand now? Leather, and in Ayers language, leather means natural material. Yeah, it's just like that. Uh, so, which question number was that? One. We cross one as well. How many questions have we crossed so far? One, two, three, and eight. That's right. Let's go on. Uh, okay, let's read on paragraph D. And is no bigger than a passport, but no bigger than a passport. Now it doesn't mean you can put passports inside. Try to understand. Not bigger than a passport means smaller than passport. But roomy enough for any insurance documents or flight tickets. A small navy blue pen is supplied inside. Yeah, a small navy blue pen is supplied. Supplied means it comes with the wallet. Supplied inside. Like you know, in the past we used to have some wallets. Us me heroines ki tasveere bhi lagi hoti thi. Pehle se hi, okay? So you could just get that. Now you understand, small navy blue pen is supplied, and for that they said something is provided for writing. Try to understand IELTS mindset, IELTS psychology. All right something is provided for writing and for that they use the word pen and for provided they use the word supplied now cross 5 as well see that if you are crossing the questions you will not read them again and that will save your time you will work smart let's go on question number uh, paragraph number e uh, this plain travel wallet opens up to reveal pockets in various colors labeled cards passport and tickets as well as other left blank for extras 
so they say this plan travel uh, this plane travel wallet opens up to reveal pockets in various colors labeled now uh, those pockets are labeled as cards passport and ticket means uske upar likha hua hai it's like that okay uh, labeled cards passport and tickets as well as others left blank for extras now six is this will suit people who want to be able to find their document wallet easily no four four is this wallet would suit someone who needs to keep several passports together they did not mention several passports together yeah agar do nahi honge to teesra to fir hoga hi na jab bach bhi teen gaye ho to kuch na kuch to lagna hi hai na ha seven something to keep this wallet in is provided go back just come back and we see here this plane travel wallet opens up to reveal pockets in various colors right labeled cards passport and tickets as well as uh, other left bl uh, blank for extras it comes in a handy drawstring bag now it comes in a handy drawstring bag you know a bag jo aap wo latak raha hota hai aapne uski string dori pakdi hoti hai that is what we call that so it comes in a handy drawstring bag so handy drawstring bag is something to keep this wallet is provided now you understand something is that bag so 7 is done 7 ko bhi kaatte hain ab kya reh gaya okay 4 and 6 and how many paragraphs two paragraphs now please come to paragraph f the black wallet features seven slip in card compartments okay seven slip in card compartment you know slip in ke card uske andar let me show you my australian wallet slip in card compartment ke card uske andar slip in kar sakte hain theek hai khali hai <laughs> okay slip in card this is actually sent by one of my students mrs kashif australia with other stuff this was one of the components perfume wallet shirt and all that yeah okay so coffee as well yeah coffee as well exactly i forgot coffee exactly yeah so let's go on they say a slip in card compartments two small interior zip pockets and a lot of other slip in compartments it can fit at least four passports yeah it can it can fit at least four passports that is this wallet would suit someone who needs to keep several for several what is the word four for several they use the word four so for question number 4 answer is f clear samajh aa rahi hai sabko daaye baaye nazar rakhe agar koi aisa aapko lag raha hai na bechara idhar udhar dekh raha hai kahan pe us pe nazar rakhni hai theek hai sabko saath leke chalna hai whoever is sitting next to you is your responsibility koi bhai ko agar neend aa rahi hai usko bhi koni maar deni kal udhar ek listening pe so raha tha maine phir kaha nahi batana nahi hai na sabne dekhna hai aise yeah he was literally sleeping i i ignored that but that's all right koi baat nahi theek hai unko bhi pata hai main unki baat kar raha hu bas ka to hota hai बस कद होते हैं ना दो बंदों को पता होता है जिसकी बात हो रही इसको भी पता होता है मेरी बात हो रही लेकिन बाकियों को नहीं पता होता ठीक है तो कोई बात नहीं बंदे को नींद आई जाती है फिर क्या हुआ अच्छा जी नाउ वी आर लेफ्ट विद क्वेश्चन नंबर हां सेवन इज ऑलरेडी डन सिक्स दिस विल सूट पीपल हु वांट टू बी एबल टू फाइंड देयर डॉक्यूमेंट वॉलेट इजीली इन देयर लगेज so last paragraph this is a simple very reasonably priced wallet it is made of pvc plastic and will suit those who like a wallet that is easy to spot easy to spot yeah it comes in a range of bright colors with a white holiday and all that easy to spot now what's the word for that this will suit people who want to be able to find their document wallet easily find their document wallet easily means easy to spot jisko dhoondna aasan ho if you do ielts reading like this test after test you will become master in ielts reading and if you do it blindly yeah then you will never get these things in cheezon pe focus karna okay that's fine